Monday motivational mood. So this week's exercise is for upper back and shoulder strength. So follow on on mobilising those joints. We need to make sure they're strong. Eddie, are you sitting in the corner with the kitten? Yeah. Okay. You're not joining in? Yeah. So it's in hands and knees. Hands are directly underneath your shoulders. Knees are directly underneath your hips. Long through the collarbone, shoulders down, and imagine there's a piece of string on the crown of your head, elongating through your spine. So we're going to work the upper back strength. We're going to bring the arm up. We're going to bring it out to the side and back in. Then we're going to do the other side. Out and back in. So while we alternate between each side, we're going to make sure we're not dropping in the elbow so like this on the other side we're keeping nice and strong and we're thinking about balancing a tray of drinks across your upper back uh, so keeping yeah. it nice and level <laughs> we're not going to hang the head down mm -hmm. we're going to try to hold the weight evenly through our spine and through our pelvis good keep the collarbones long shoulders down we're going to repeat eight to ten on each side. Not only will it strengthen your back and shoulders, your wrist and elbow as we load in through those joints. So you want to make it harder. Number two. Hands directly underneath your shoulders, knees directly underneath your hips. We're going to do one at a time. But we're going to bring in a leg stretch behind us. We're going to bring the other arm up. Hetty, leave them alone. And back down. Let them go. Let him go. Let him go. Good girl. Put him on the floor, see what he wants to do. So we're gonna to try to keep that leg up. So children and animals, they say. I think I've got both in the room. And then we're gonna do the other side. So we lengthen the leg up, squeeze the buttocks. Opposite arms up, out and back in. So we're going to aim to do about 8 to 10 on each side and if you can repeat it 2 to 3 times. What we don't want is neck pain and shoulder pain. Your wrist will probably be uh, protesting so just give it a little bit of a rest then go back into it. So that's your Monday motivational move for upper back strength.